When someone hears the words liver cancer, one of the first questions that comes up is, do I need surgery or do I need a liver transplant? It's a fair question and the answer isn't always obvious. Hi, I'm Dr. Sanket Mehta, surgical oncologist from SSO Cancer Center. Let me break it down. If the tumor is localized, meaning it's confined to one part of the liver and the rest of the liver is functioning well, no major cirrhosis, no portal hypertension, then we typically go for surgery to remove the tumor. This is called as hepatectomy and it's often the more straightforward option. But sometimes liver cancer arises in a damaged liver from long-term hepatitis, alcohol use or from other chronic diseases. In these cases, even if we remove the tumor, the remaining liver may not be strong enough to support life. That's when a liver transplant becomes the better option. Because now we are not just treating the cancer, we are also replacing the entire damaged organ. Sometimes we use a combined approach. First, we do surgery to control the cancer. Later, if needed, we plan for a transplant. This is called as bridging or sequential therapy and it's used in carefully selected patients. So, it's not about what's more aggressive or high tech, it's about choosing the right path based on how well your liver is functioning, how is the tumor behaving and how fit you are overall. If you or someone you care about is facing this decision, please know there is no one size fits all answer. The right plan is personalized, built around you and not just the disease. And if this helped make things clearer, share it forward. It could help someone ask the right questions.